The U.S. Defense Security Cooperation Agency on September 20 announced that the State Department had made a determination approving a possible foreign military sale to the government of Kuwait of repair and recertification of Patriot Advanced Capability, three missiles and support for an estimated cost of $150 million. The government of Kuwait has requested the replacement of expiring limited life components and certifications testing in order to support an operational life of 30, 30, years for Patriot Advanced Capability, 3, Pack 3, missiles. Included in this potential sale are, test and repair of Pack 3 missiles, stockpile reliability testing and field returns, repair and return of classified and unclassified Pack 3 missile items and ground support equipment, GSE, component level parts, replenishment of classified and unclassified missile spares, GSE spares, and seeker spares. Tools to improve the turnaround time of the repair and recertification efforts, air transportation services for missile processing, U.S. government and contractor technical and logistics support, training devices, organizational equipment, support equipment, test equipment, technical data and publications, personnel training and training equipment, and other related elements of logistics and program support. The estimated total cost is $150 million. The principal contractor will be the Lockheed Martin Corporation, Camden, Arkansas. Implementation of this proposed sale will not require the assignment of any additional U.S. government or contractor representatives to Kuwait. The PAC-3 family of missiles defends against incoming threats using direct body-to-body -body contact that delivers exponentially more kinetic energy on the target than can be achieved with blast fragmentation mechanisms. Building on the Combat Proven Pack 3 Cost Reduction Initiative, CRI, the Pack 3 Missile Segment Enhancement, MSE, expands the lethal battle space with a two-pulse solid rocket motor, providing increased performance in altitude and range.